from Los Angeles, California. You're watching Connect TV. So you're the Argonne guy? Guess it sucks to be you right now. <laughs> All right, have a seat in this chair over here. Cassie, get him some powder, will you? About how long will we be taping? No, we're going live with this. Had to move up the airliner story, you know. Wait a minute, live? So how do you spell that, S-P-I-T-S? -S? With a Z. With a Z, got it. <laughs> but I had been told this was a taped interview. Oh, here she is. <laughs> Katrina, this is Mr. Zitz, the Argonne guy. Katrina George, Mr. Zitz, thanks for coming. Spitz, Cameron Spitz, <laughs> with a Z. Whatever, Katrina, is there anything you need? No, I'm good. Mr. Zitz, are you feeling okay? That's Spitz. <laughs> Whatever. Angelica, I think Cameron's coming up next. No, that would be my breakfast. I thought they said they were taping it for later. Okay, Katrina, we're on in five, four, three. New scientific studies pointing to the argon gas used in poultry processing as creating, shall we say, dramatic health impacts. I'm Katrina George, and I'm here with Cameron Zitz, spokesperson for the American Argon Association. Mr. Zitz, what does the American Argon Association have to say about these disturbing reports? That spits. Well, Katrina, Cameron I Zitz. Think oh, I can't that believe are... that. Oh, he doesn't look too good. NIH. Nonetheless, America's Archon producers take safety with the utmost seriousness. <laughs> Therefore, we are working with the <laughs> poultry industry. Uh oh. <laughs> Just how and much so of Leslie's kimchi hummus did he eat? A lot. <laughs> A whole lot. Moratorium on the use of argon in. Product for for human <laughs> consumption. <laughs> this is really bad. Really bad. Do I smell Korean pickles? <laughs> wow, I haven't seen anything this embarrassing since Tom Cruise was on Oprah's couch. 